tracking, always alerting. Storm Team 8. And welcome back on a cold morning. 30 degree temperature currently in Grand Rapids. East wind at 6 miles an hour. The good news today is we'll have the sunshine and we'll warm things up with a gentle breeze out there. Even though temperatures overall will be a little bit below average today. It's going to be a really nice spring day. Uh, we just have to get past the morning hours and dealing with the cold. If you look closely though, the live view in this Holland camera, you can actually see some high level clouds out there. So it's going to add to a beautiful sunrise this morning. 30 degree temperature, Grand Rapids, 31 Kalamazoo, 32 in Muskegon. So the vast majority of the viewing area right now at or below freezing. It's a cold morning out there and it looks like this will likely be the last morning that we hit temperatures at the freezing mark at least in the metropolitan areas colder this morning compared to yesterday yesterday was colder than the previous day so that's the trend we're reversing that it looks like beginning this afternoon a warming trend begins this afternoon will take us right through the weekend right now the wind is fairly light out there and you can see some of those high level clouds also that area of high pressure that gave us all that sunshine yesterday afternoon continues uh, close enough to us that we're going to squeeze out another day with a lot more sunshine there are some more clouds off to the west of us and eventually the those will move in for Friday. In the meantime, enjoy this beautiful weather today, albeit a little on the cool side. Uh, looks like tonight, a few high level clouds coming in and gradually thickening up throughout the day on Friday. And eventually we'll have a chance of an evening shower or thunderstorm as it appears. So if you have any evening plans out there, a lot of us head out and you know get dinner or whatever, catch a movie or a show or whatever, uh, you may need the umbrella. The reason why we'll have that chance of showers and thunderstorms, warm front moving through, and that is certainly going to bring in some warmer temperatures. And I wanted to show you this. We'll, with that warm front and a humid air mass in place, throughout the weekend we'll have occasional chances of showers and thunderstorms. Saturday, the Storm Prediction Center always ha already has us in a marginal to a slight risk for the pot potential of some of those storms being strong to severe. We'll keep an eye on that for you. Uh, more chances of uh, showers and thunderstorms uh, for Sunday and also Monday. Look how warm it is this weekend with highs mid, even perhaps upper 70s and those lows in the 60s. It's actually going to feel a little bit like summer out there, Tom. Okay, I have good news for everyone on this Thursday morning. Northbound US 131 at 28th Street is now open and all lanes are open. Uh, from Burton through downtown Grand Rapids. So no problems developing there. So we have about a day and a half, two days here to enjoy that before the closures go into place along southbound US 131. Those will happen on Sunday. So what we're going to look at for that closing Sunday, southbound US 131 at Burton, and that is going to remain in place through 28th Street through May 24th. And going along with that, just like what we saw on the northbound side, we are going to see double lane closures along southbound US 131 beginning at Ann Street through Burton, and that is going to go through May 24. So enjoy today and tomorrow's morning commute. I will have another update for you coming up in about 15 minutes. Donovan.